we can take a quick look on Atom actually, guys. Also a very nice big short opportunity on AVEX. As you can see, guys, so I don't know, but if you're not seeing this resistance around $43, it's basically a triple top at this point. Right here, top, right here, and also right here. So very big resistance for Atom around $43, guys. And right over here, as you can see, we had two times a very nice short opportunity at this point over here you could even set a very tight stop loss position and you can make up to 104 105 risk reward on this short range right over here and it played out perfectly um that's why i i'm always telling you guys not to chase breakouts because if you take a look at this price section right over here you can see that we broke above $43.90 and I think a lot of people been chasing this uh, breakout over here because they are not patient enough and right now as you can see we are already down from this previous high around let's see around 20% right now and they are just getting liquidated and stopped out again on the way down guys and that's why I'm always telling you wait for confirmed breakout if you are closing some four hour candles above it then there is a possibility to make maybe another breakout trade but with um this type of price action i would definitely not consider to take a breakout trade right here so for atem guys um i think atem will most likely go down over the next couple of weeks i would say back again to about 30 dollars or so because like phantom also um atem did already a very huge run-up of about 120 percent from 20 dollars to about 45 dollars and right now i think all the people who've been taking long positions on the way down somewhere between 20 to about 26 dollars or so they're just taking out their profits and also all these breakout chasers just taking out their long positions they are just getting stopped out and liquidated and i think we will maybe see some sideways consolidation over the next couple of days and then i think there's a very high possibility that atem could break down back again to about i would say 29 30 dollars actually this would be the next area i would take a look at right now because as you can see also from the past price action guys right over here this would be actually the next huge layer of support and at this point we had already also right here very clear breakout around 29 dollars that's why i think atom could definitely go down back again to about yeah 34 percent from the top to about 29 dollars but i also would say that we will see first of all a big bounce from here from 33 dollars to about 39 42 dollars or so and then some choppy price action then we will see most likely a breakdown this is what i think will most likely happen to item guys if you are breaking above this previous all-time high around 44 dollars then my next target like i marked it already right over here would be around 60 dollars but for now i am way more bearish than bullish to be honest with you because like I said, the opportunity was already here to take out some profits, a run-up of about 110%. And I think right now the run-up is already over and we will see a pullback to about $29 actually.